Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a clean the cleaners video and how to clean your Dyson upright vacuum cleaner. As you can see there, mine was pretty filthy from all the spring cleaning. So first thing you want to do is remove the canister from the machine. Just push the button there to pull it apart. Then on the back, you'll be able to open the trap door. Pull the machine apart. You can see there, look how filthy that is. Ugh, it's just gross. Full of hair and dust and dirt. Gross. So then you want to pull that all apart and just put it away in the sink or wherever. Uh, to remove the first filter, you just open the top. Look how dirty that is too. Hair. Pull all that hair off, throw it in the garbage, and yeah, make a gross face. Second filter is located in the ball, so just recline your vacuum cleaner and then find the the little button hatch door there to open the ball up and then you can extract the what I'm going to call the plastic filter. This one doesn't really get that dirty but it still needs to be clean just like the rest of them. Next you're going to want to take out the beater bar, bristle bar, I don't really know what it's called, the thing that picks up the stuff. So just use a coin, I'm using a nickel and just find the little screw type thing on the left hand side there as you can see turn it pull it out look how gross that is use a scissor if yours is as bad as my postpartum hair loss which is finally settled down now cut all the strips and hair and crap off of there throw it in the garbage and you're left with a clean nice clean bar and a clump of filth get rid of that just throw it back in there and then give the whole thing a wipe down Guys, how gross is this? Please tell me I'm not the only one with a filthy vacuum cleaner. Ew. I ended up like scrubbing the inside of this with a scrubby brush, but then just lay them out to dry. I like to put mine outside, reassemble it all, and your vacuum is clean as new. If you have to focus on any scuffs, I would recommend using like a magic eraser or the Dollar Tree alternative, which actually works really awesome. Thanks guys for watching. I hope your vacuum cleaner isn't as filthy as mine. Let me know in the comments how often you get to cleaning yours and if you have a Dyson how much you love it because I really love mine. Don't forget to hit subscribe and give this video a thumbs up if you can't wait for the next video in the Clean the Cleaner series. Thanks again from Hampers and Hiccups. See you next time.